awesome. All right, see you soon. What are you using? Oh, Masenko. I'm doing a challenge with another YouTuber. It's a big bass challenge. So whoever catches the biggest bass pretty much wins, but the person who loses has to jump in the lake. No way. And he lives like up north somewhere. So if he has to jump in the lake, he's gonna be freezing. I'm hoping I win though. Oh, I got a fish. Hang on one sec. There's a fish. No, it's not that big. Hello? All right, there we go. Oh my gosh. Look how he was hooked. He's skin hooked on the top of the nose. What the heck? All right guys, first fish of the day. I'm actually doing a challenge right now. I'll explain it to you in a second, but let me release this guy real quick. See ya. Just a little guy, about a pound. I was actually FaceTiming my friend right now. He's coming to fish with me. But anyways, we're gonna be fishing this spot. It's a pretty new spot. I fished here like once before, but we're gonna try to figure it out. Hopefully we'll get a ton of fish and hopefully some big fish too. So I'll explain to you what the challenge I'm doing right now is. Let me switch to the big camera. All right guys, so what's happening right now is I'm doing a big bass challenge with another YouTuber. He lives up north, so we can't fish together, but his name's Sawyer. I'll leave his channel linked below in the description. Make sure you guys check it out. But anyways, what we're doing is whoever catches the biggest bass wins. We have two hours and whoever loses has to jump in a lake. So I'm hoping I win. I'm gonna try to catch at least a three. I think that'll be enough to beat him. I'll probably maybe get a four today. I'm fishing a fairly new spot. I've been here once before. So I should be able to figure it out, at least get one big one, and let's get to it. All right guys, one fish down. It was about a pound. Definitely not gonna be the winner. But the setup I'm using is a Pisifun Torrent and a Shimano Metanium DC. Hopefully, we'll get some bigger fish. Do I have a fish? I have a fish. What the heck? Oh my gosh. I had a little bass. He just came off. That was really weird. That was cool. Alright, second fish of the day. Definitely not going to help. This thing's less than a pound. Second fish of the day. Fat little guy. That was cool. All right, another tiny bass. Not good for the competition, but that was a really sick eat. I was reeling my Senko in, and this guy followed it all the way up. Just a little guy. See you. All right, guys, I switched to a spinner bait. I feel like I'll get more bites with a moving bait. We'll see what happens. There's a fish. Oh, it's a mine. Well, first fish on the spinner bait. It's a mine, though. All right, there he goes. Hopefully we'll get a bass next. Well, I got a bass. That's a tiny little bass on the spinner bait though. Can't believe this guy ate the spinner bait. See ya. Oh, there's a fish, big fish, big fish. I just fell over. Oh my gosh. What the heck? I was not ready for that. It's not that big. Oh my gosh. He came out of nowhere. I was not expecting that. I was reeling in faster than normal just to try it. And this guy came up and crushed it. Probably about a one and a half. I don't think I'll win it with this, but we're upgrading. That's a better fish. See ya.
Oh, there's a fish. That was sick. All right, that's a decent bass. I will take that. Long and chunky, that's a good fish. See ya. Oh God, he just got me all muddy. Oh, oh my gosh. Dang, I thought that was a huge bass. It's a decent snakehead. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Come here. Oh no. Oh no. This is not good. Oh my gosh. I want to snap off. This is my only spinnerbait, which is a big problem. Oh gosh. Come here. Alright. We're good. We're good. Oh no. Oh no. All right, we're good. Ooh. All right, we're good. He's on land. Oh no, oh no, we're not good, we're not good, we're not good. Oh gosh, now I gotta get the spinner bait out of his mouth. Jeez. Sorry guys, my GoPro's about to run out of battery. All right guys, just got probably a four or five pound snakehead. That's a pretty big snakehead. I don't know if we're counting snakehead, but if we are, I think I just won. I think we're just doing a bass only challenge though, but anyways, this probably won't help. It's like a five pounder though. He just came out from under those weeds and smoked my spinner bait. It was crazy. See you bud. That's so sick. Alright guys, so I kind of underestimated how much time I'd have. I don't know if you can tell on the camera right now, but it's actually getting pretty dark. I know my camera kind of compensates for that. But anyways, I'm going to head in. I fish probably about an hour. So tomorrow I'm going to come back, fish another hour, and hopefully get on some more fish. So see you guys tomorrow. Yeah. That was pretty cool. It's not that big. Alright. Jesus. No! It's fine. Oh. Oh, that's actually a decent one. Am I recording? Honestly, I thought it was like really tiny. Oh, I am recording. Okay. Oh! Fish on! First bass for me of the day. Pretty chunky. Battle one. See ya. Oh, I got one. Big? Decent. Big. Yeah, honestly, that felt big. It's not bad. Oh, he likes jumping. Bro, the bass today have fought pretty hard. He's jumped like three times. Oh my gosh. Oh, I just threw him on a rock. All right, he's fine. That was almost bad. If he landed like an inch that way, he would have hit that rock. I was just like someone's going. Oh! That was cool. Oh my god. That's a decent one. Another bass. A little smaller than the last one, but I'll take it. See ya.
Oh gosh. Oh my god. Alright guys, awesome peacock. Really pretty two and a half pounder. There's an even bigger one right under there. Let's get a release. There he goes. Alright, let's get the other one. Alright guys, that is going to do it for this big bass challenge. The biggest bass I ended up getting was only a around a two pounder. It was a peacock bass. So I ended up tying with Sawyer. Again, his channel will be in the description. Make sure you guys check it out. But anyways, in the spring, we're going to do this again and hopefully get on some bigger bass. This time was a little disappointing. But anyways, when we have the rematch, the loser of that will jump in the lake. So, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll catch you next time on the next episode of Fishing Forward.